99. I mean, when people see it, they think it's a white topaz or a white sapphire. It looks like it's thousands and thousands of dollars. It's beautiful. I mean, that's like an insult to the piece. That's not a jewelry store gemstone. It should be in a collector's box. And this is again, grossly underpriced. I, this is my second time in my 16 years that I have showcased Mexican highlight. It's a, a very remarkable, uh, oh, oh, rather a, a remarkable highlight opal. Uh, and uh, there was one found in 2013 in uh, Zacatecas, Mexico, and it was a daylight fluorescent, uh, meaning that it will fluoresce under regular daylight conditions, no ultraviolet light at all. Uh, this is not going to happen at a store near you because you're not going to find it. You're just, and I truthfully, now, not that I tune into the other networks 24-7, uh, you know, a week, but I've never seen it anywhere else but here. It, you won't. I've never seen it anywhere else but here. You have to go to a rock and mineral show, and it won't be transparent like this. Oh, and aren't we in the month of, we're in the month of October. Mm -hmm. Opal is the first one for the month of October. And just to be clear, this is a very rare colorless fluorescent opal this is a tr this belongs in the opal family why wow. because it is an opal and, and most people who celebrate the month of october their birthday uh, have never heard of it it's that rare you're not going to find it when you nope. go to the mall you know they're going to have all of the birthstones there and when you look at the birthstone for the month of october you'll see the traditional opal probably australian maybe some ethiopian opal we're starting to see that distinguish uh from the the, uh, the market there but you'll never see mexican highlight it is an opal what it's a, of? A, a true clear opal mm -hmm. and for 167.99 paid in full for a beautiful neck piece like so that's gorgeous <coughs> again <coughs> Oh, I got a little froggy in my throat. We've got to move with the clock, you guys. Really I'm so sad piece. to put this back on this shelf. I tell you what, if you see it again, uh, it's likely you're not going to be in fall clearance and you